Okay, guys, this is the review of these new shoes I got. And these are called STEM Barefoot Shoes. And I believe the company's changed their name. It's called STEM, but I think now they're called Lemming. But anyway, I found these online and uh, I always wanted to try these kind of minimalist shoes. But I never really wanted the... I tried on the Vibram Five Fingers and I didn't really like much having things between my toes. It didn't feel all that natural. And so the search went on. I found these online. And the thing I like about them is they look... I'll back up here. They look pretty much like normal shoes. And most of the other minimalist shoes or so-called barefoot shoes look kind of different. I know there's some much nicer ones out there, but these are reasonably priced. And they, I believe they were $89 online. And so a little bit about the company. They've changed their name. They used to be called STEM. Now they're called Lemming. But they're quite good. When I called them, they sent the order pretty quick. But due to an incorrect address somehow there was a mistake on the envelope or the, the package it was late but the post office got it to me anyway but when I called to uh, when I emailed STEM the guy just he was like oh okay I'll just send another pair and he was about to send them when uh, the post office confirmed that they were here they were just at the wrong address and I got them a day about a day later so that was great uh, good service on their part I think it's only one guy I think it's like the CEO and a couple of workers or helpers, whatever. So about the shoes, they're so-called minimalist because they're very flexible. I guess everybody's done this to them online. As you can see, they've got a pretty nice grip here or whatever. I'm no expert. Uh, I'm no runner. I've run in them on the treadmill a few times, but I've walked a lot. And if you're not used to minimalist shoes, which I have a pair of kind of aqua socks that I was using as minimalist shoes, so I've had a chance to get used to it. And mostly on the treadmill for light running, but it does take some getting used to on your ankles and your lower back. So if you're not used to it, you gotta kinda ease into it. But I just wanna say, I'm reviewing these because they made my back feel really good. Like, I didn't have any particular back problems, like my sciatica, my sciatic nerve or whatever. It hurts sometimes. But uh, I had other, like, minor stiffness and stuff. It all seemed to clear up when I started walking in bare feet, shoe, uh, these minimalist shoes. So I don't know how much, why the, not having that heel there I mean, you know, this this is just the material, but they're supposedly have a neutral heel. It's the same thickness here as here. I didn't get a caliper or anything. That being said, it seems to make a big difference. I can't explain why. And you'll notice, like, the this part is much wider than a normal shoe. And maybe I'll... Uh, I don't have any other shoes here. But anyway, other shoes are kind of like... A little more pointy here so it lets your toes spread out as opposed to being jammed in there like this I got blisters I put about I think I've put about I've had these about two months I think and I have put about 60 kilometers uh, of walking on them I guess that's uh, 36 miles and they're starting to wear out a little bit like I don't know if you can see that but I washed them once maybe that was why so Maybe can't blame the company, but the, some of the threads are coming out, and there's a thread coming out here. But I had to because I was getting blisters, and they're popping. But the blisters were because I think it's because I had to get used to walking on it. You you have more pressure on your heel and the ball of your foot, so somehow it would. And you know, there's not much between you and the road, and they've got really good road feel, by the way. You can feel every nook and cranny without having to step on sharp stuff, which is the beauty of minimalist shoes. Um, 
So that being said, I got blisters, but they've gone away since then, since I've gotten used to it. And I, I just had to ease up for a while and let the blisters heal. And then I guess my feet toughened up a bit, but they're really nice. So I highly recommend this. They're called Lemming Shoes. Just find them online. The guy is like really excellent when it comes to customer service. And another thing about them, honestly, is they're really comfortable. Like you can wear them with, they say that, uh, someone told me that you get the blisters because of your socks, which may or may not be true, I don't know. But when I stopped wearing socks, it, the blisters were already going away, so that may have helped. But these are quite comfy inside, like I don't know if you can see that, it's like a soft kind of, almost, well a little bit silky-ish material. So you can wear them with no socks and they feel pretty good. I just wasn't used to it, but I'm kind of getting used to it now. But the beauty of it too is you can wear socks with these and they look like normal shoes, like no one would really know if you're walking down the street in these. Uh, it's got these little knobs on the bottom and they're not worn away yet, so I guess that means they're gonna last a while longer as long as these threads or whatever don't keep popping off and they don't fall apart. So I'm hoping to get at least a year out of these bad boys. And they've got like little sayings written all over them about their company or whatever. But I don't, you need a microscope pretty, you, had, you need to be pretty damn close to your foot to see that. But they're nice. I just wanna say I really recommend these. They come in four different styles, but they, the main difference seems to be the color and men's and women's. So men have two styles and women have two styles or two colors. And I think they have a, a solid black color now. And now it's called lemming and not stem. But anyway, that's my review. I'm not a minimalist shoe expert, but these, and this is my first pair. So I hope you guys enjoyed the review. And oh, I, I just want to tell you one more thing. The laces are like kind of long and they're kind of, um, Anyway, they're really great, so yeah, I highly recommend them if you're interested in not looking too, you know, if you don't, if you want to kind of blend in but still have a good minimalist shoe, I think this is the choice. You know, if you like Vibram Five Fingers, then you know, go for it. But these are the shoes for me, for now, and I'm probably going to get another pair because if these wear out. They seem to be making improvements all the time. I guess they are. So, anyway, there you have it. Stems. Oh, now they're called lemmings. Lemming footwear. Check them out.